previously look like the other ones. Every match has They're been different. different. There's been 10 0 techs. There's been the, the crazy one where he got the three in overtime. And now we're underway. Match number two of this series. Jordan Burroughs in the blue. Kyle Dake in the red. And it's Dake with a 1 0 lead. And Burroughs needs to win two straight. And it starts right now. Cheers from the home crowd for Burroughs. Dake taking match one. Came out to a big lead. Burroughs clawed back. Unable to get ahead. Actually, he tied it. 6-6, six, six, but Dake led on criteria. The big four-point throw. Through chest strap, threw him over the top. Nice clear there by, by Jordan Burroughs. Doesn't want to be in that underhook. And there's a shot right away. Because they're going to hold up red. And is it Dake already one for passivity? Zach Eric, great official, officiated at the Olympic Games on the whistle. Burroughs, heavy hands, clubs on the head though. But, but those are those are good legal yeah. hands there. Now two on one, this is a great control tie here for Kyle Dake, he's very effective. Two on ones and underhooks, that's where Dake wants to be all day long. Shot from space. The two on one tactic is something that not just it's not just um, Dake that's tried the two on one. A lot of guys have. Kyle, and now got Kyle. Poked uh, in the eye again. Complaining, yeah, to the ref. Maybe that he got poked in the eye, poked in the face. You'll see Jordan push on the shoulders, push on the shoulders, sometimes smack on the face. Dake controls the elbow. Shot by Dake, but it's a good sprawl. And now it's Burroughs going to get one for passivity. Halfway through the first, each guy been warned. Oh, nice miss Jordan goes back. opposite side, he gets to the leg. Burroughs has him in the air, he's looking to score. Could he just take it out for the one? Might be wise here. Uh, that's not even an easy thing. Kyle Dake's gonna push right back in bounds. The last foot is the toughest. Jordan's head hit out of bounds. There's Jordan's eight. head hit out of bounds. That's a point for Dake. And Dake points to the head. And savvy, savvy, you know, you have that foot, one foot away from the edge, and it's Jordan Burroughs, uh, Kyle Dake, able to somehow counter, like only Kyle Dake can. Yeah, he's got one foot, and he's standing on the edge, and he's pushing back so hard that Jordan can't get him out of bounds. Pressure, pressure. So once again, we're seeing Burroughs attack, get to the leg, and it's Dake able to counter. Dake so poised when he's in danger like that. It's a combination of strength, flexibility, and just great mat awareness. That, that is, you know, just at, at the domestic level unseen, but even internationally, there's not many guys that can do what Dake did just there against Jordan Burroughs. Short time. Oh, and he gets in again. Kyle Dake's going to score another a takedown, and he's going to go up 3-1. Kyle Dake in the driver's seat. Are we seeing the changing of the guard right this moment, Christian? Could Jordan, be. Jordan's going to have something to say about that. But certainly things are trending Kyle Dake's way. Didn't think we would see that. But here we are. There's a shot. Dake once again able to catch him. Front headlock. Underhook tried to push him. Dake now on two knees. Oh, boy. 3-0, Kyle Dake leading at the break. And I'm speechless right now as we're on the precipice of something absolutely huge happening. Drop Kyle home. Dake potentially unseating Jordan Burroughs. Kid Dynamite. Burroughs looks calm. That's three minutes on the board. Burroughs needs to attack and he does. And immediately stopped with the underhook of Dake. Kyle Dake's defense, world class. And moving yeah, to the ground. <laughs> slipping those punches, not punches, but slipping the wax. Burroughs. 
his head out the way was Day. And you know, it's the, uh, the other elephant in the room here is where's the double? We haven't seen it as much in the Open. We're not, we didn't see it at the Olympics and we're not seeing it now. We're seeing him go single leg. And really maybe that's the solution for Jordan right now, but man, one of those textbook Jordan Burroughs head in the chest blast doubles will be just what he needs to get him back in this match. 2.05 to go, Dake still leading. Kyle Dake wrestling masterfully. And now it's Dake with his, uh, or Burroughs with his butt towards the center in position to maybe get put on the shot clock. And that could be huge. If Dake goes on the clock here, then he's within a takedown if it, that shot clock runs out. Zach Garrett indicating towards Kyle Dake. Let's see if it's confirmed. Yes, Kyle Dake's gonna go on the shot clock. And Dake saying something to the official again about the hand of the face, I suppose. No need for Dake to have to do anything silly here. I wouldn't expect him to take an unnecessary risk. But one thing we've seen with Dake, at least in his history, when he goes on the clock, he often looks to strike. But here in this situation, it's not as necessary. So you have a three-point lead, maybe not put yourself at risk. But I don't know what risk taking attack, uh, Kyle Dake taking attack really puts him at. We haven't seen the reattacks from Jordan as time runs out and throw the point on the board. It's 3-1. Now Burles is within a takedown, and we'll see if there's oh, a shot. An attack. Jordan's in on the leg. He's caught underneath this with Dake took him over for four last time. Burroughs is going to have to be careful underneath. And he's going to plant himself on the mat. I don't think he's going to try to finish this. I think he's going to try to not get taken through. So he got in. Wow. Not able to finish. 54 seconds to go. Dake leading Burroughs 3-1. to one. Head taps there from Burroughs. Trying to create an angle of some kind. You got to finish quick on Kyle Dake. Nine times out of ten. If you don't finish quick, there's a single leg. Standing single. Grab the two. Champ. It's two and two. two. A takedown to tie it for Jordan Burroughs. 3-3. Three, three. He has the lead on criteria. 36 seconds to go. Jordan Burroughs makes the fans on their feet. We see his family, his parents, his wife, his yeah. kids. And we see 30 seconds to go. Kyle Dake's going to have a furious pace here. All he needs is to take Burroughs out of bounds. Find another the shot. Somehow. And there you have it. It's going to be one, two. Kyle Dake, two point takedown. And do you challenge here? Oh, it's 5-5 five, five on the board here. I don't think that's right. Is that possibly right? No, I don't know if I would have challenged that. It's 5-5 five, five on the board. Red line underneath Kyle Dake. So they gave. We'll take a look at this replay and Dake in on the leg. Burroughs thinking he was down. Here we see it again. So they went two and two for Jordan. And I thought that looks like a one. But I don't know. Still conferring. And I think they want to take another look at the officials. You see Burroughs looking up at the big screen. 23 seconds going to be left when we come back from this challenge, regardless of of how it goes. On, and it's hard we'll to take a look at it one more time. So it was 5-3 Burroughs at the exchange. They went two and two there, and that was the thing we missed. Oh, there. they gave a turn to Burroughs. I don't think that's two. And look, by the time Eric holds up his left hand, I don't think that's takedown criteria. If they let him go a little bit more, he's grounded. That's not two. That is not two. Here comes your challenge. One, one red. Burroughs leads. One red. Burroughs will have the lead. 5-4, 23 seconds to go. And Rob, Rob Cole's Cole livid. Giving it to Rick Tucci, the head official here. And it's the lead for Burroughs, but 23 seconds for That's Kyle Dake. That's enough time for Kid Dynamite. And now, if you're look, thinking criteria, a one for Dake's not going to do it. I believe he's going to need a takedown. And here he comes. He's looking for it. 
Fast and furious is Kyle Dake, needing a takedown. Underhook for Jordan Burroughs, right side. He's clear. Look at the over the top. Burroughs in on the leg. Burroughs just needs to hang on for 10 seconds. Kyle trying to come He's to the cross. He's the cross. Kyle might take He's him through. Here. No. Wow. Burroughs does Burrows it. Holds on. Force and match three. Can Burrows you believe holds it? On. Burroughs hangs on. And it's going to be a third match. And look at the emotion on Jordan Burroughs. Take unhappy. He screamed one more. One more. Jordan Burroughs knows he's one match away from still being on top. Wow. Electricity here in the Devaney Center on the campus of the University of Nebraska. When Kyle Dake lifts from that crotch lift, he's scoring against everybody. everybody. Almost everybody. Jordan Burroughs able to not get exposed there after he's completely lifted off. Amazing, amazing sequence. And let's go to that final sequence. Let's check it out. I don't think Burrow's exposed. Time was up by the time he did. If anything, it's two, two and two. Two blue, they said. They gave two blue on that. And there the raise in his hand. Jordan, Jordan Burrow's takes match number two. Final score, eight to four. Oh. Kyle Day can't be happy. He wrestled his tail off, was a hair away from doing it. We will see a third and decisive match. Unbelievable match. What heart both guys.